้าช้าจะพยายามอย่าตาช้าเลยช้าเลยช้าเลยพี่ชายจะโอนได้ไหมขอเลย Prior to becoming a monk, all hair must be removed from the man's head. This is done the night before the ceremony, and it starts by the parents removing three lots of hair, and then each family member or close friend to also do the same. But only friends or family who are older than the man can actually do it. This ritual is performed on temple grounds. You can see his very proud parents lovingly removing some of his hair. They remove as much hair as they can to make the process of shaving easier for the monk. All the hair, including the eyebrows, must be removed from the head. The majority of Thai men will accept the honor of becoming a monk at some stage in their life. They can either choose to devote their whole life to being a monk, or to stay as a monk for a short period, and this can be done before or after they get married. In my friend's case. He is married with a son, and he'll be a monk for a period of two weeks. Monks are forbidden from having any physical contact with women, and this, of course, will be the case for my friend also. He and his wife won't even be able to hold hands during the next two weeks. It's not a grim process. The monk even shaves a mohawk, at least time for the family to take photos. Who said that monks didn't have a sense of humour? A paste of turmeric and water is now applied to all of the exposed parts of the body. Turmeric is what monks have traditionally used to dye their robes.
The man must now apologise to his parents for any bad that he has done, any time that he has said bad to their face or behind their back. And he also must do hand respect to their feet and also wash their feet as a deep sign of his love and respect for them. Starting with the parents, each person present to witness the ceremony washes turmeric from the man's body. Man and his parents now take part in a Ligatong ceremony. Say a prayer before releasing the hair into the water. After the day's events, and depending on the family situation, they either have a, a huge party to celebrate, or they have a quiet night of reflection.